गाइस टुडे वी विल डिस्कस द नॉर्मलाइजेशन वी विल जस्ट टेक एन इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ नॉर्मलाइजेशन एज वी आर डिस्कसिंग द रिलेशनल डेटाबेस डिजाइन सो नॉर्मलाइजेशन एंड द फंक्शनल डिपेंडेंसी इज द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट पार्ट ऑफ दिस रिलेशनल डेटाबेस डिजाइन तो लेट्स डिस्कस वट इज एक्जैक्टली नॉर्मलाइजेशन वी विल जस्ट टेक एन इंट्रोडक्शन ओके गाइज सी नॉर्मलाइजेशन इज द प्रोसेस बाय विच वी डिकम्पोज और डिवाइड एनी रिलेशन इन टू मोर देन वन रिलेशन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल it is a process of decomposing or dividing a relation into a smaller relation in this we divide a table into a smaller table to remove anomalies from database that is if you want to remove the anomalies so normalization gives the process by which we can divide or decompose the big table into a smaller one so we can remove the all the anomalies from the database anomalies like insert anomalies deletion anomalies and updation anomalies so we want to remove that anomalies we have seen the what are the uh, disadvantages of that anomalies so we want to remove if that anomalies we have to use the concept or process of normalization let's see another thing it is a step by step process let's see it is a step by step process and each step is known as normal forms it is a step by step process of dividing a table it is a step by step we cannot divide every every table in, in once no we have to take a step by step process for dividing that table for removing the anomalies and every step in the normalization is known as normal forms it is a reversible process guys if let's see if you are at the fourth level or the fourth process level and you think that now you have done the wrong things so if you want to revert back yes you can revert back to the third level so it is a reversible process <clears throat> let's see the benefits of normalization what are the benefits or advantages of using the normalization the smaller table with the smaller rows if we divide the table so it will be a smaller one if we divide the table then there will be a small number of rows because we are removing the anomalies okay guys searching sorting and creating indexes are faster in this the searching and the sorting section that means if you want to search something or if you want to sort some data on the basis of some criteria pattern so you can do it easily and and the moreover the creating indexes are faster because the indexes are basically the methodology by which we uh, try to search or quickly search some data so uh, indexes are quickly we can make it and we can apply different types of indexes over the tables after that small number of null values and less redundant data that is a part of anomalies from anomalies so if we remove all the anomalies so there will be a small null values and plus there will be less redundant data as we know okay guys so by dividing the tab big table into a smaller one up according to some properties all these benefits are going to become after that the data modification anomalies that is the updation anomalies are reduced we know also that ki in the updation anomaly what happened there so if we want to remove that anomalies we have to use the normalization after that the easier to maintain and change as the need change it is quite easy for us to maintain the database or table if you apply the normalization plus if there is a in a future there is a if you want some change in database or in a table so we can go according to our need okay guys so we can change it easily after that it reduces the data dependency the the lots of data depends on other data so if there are lots of data and lots of dependencies there so there creates some problems so it reduces that data dependency okay guys <clears throat> after that there are types of normal form that means the types of the processes or step by step processes which are known as the normal forms let's see the first normal form the first process is known as the first normal form that is known as 1 nf okay guys after the second normal form second nf third normal form is third nf yeah three nf then the after that the next process is known as boys code normal form okay guys that is known as the bc nf in short all these process all these normal form that first normal for form normal form which depends on the functional dependency it is a part of relation database design where we find some uh, there are columns and we find some uh, properties according to base we depend we find out how they depend on each other or not so that is known as the functional dependency we will study in the next session but this all these four normal forms depends on the functional dependency okay guys after that the point comes the four and a form this is fourth normal form which is based on the 
multi value dependency okay guys and after that the fifth normal form that is five normal form based on the joint dependency so there are the different types of joint uh, dependency we will study start studying from the next session so according to that dependency we apply some dependency on first normal form then some dependency on another normal form so step by step we will study a dependency and apply it on the normal form then study the second dependency and apply it on the second normal form so in this way we are going to study all the normal forms and the dependency okay guys we are not going to study all the dependency in one time and then up do the normal forms in one time no we will study first nor uh, first dependency then apply it on the that normal form okay guys so this will be the, our procedure so so we will follow that procedure uh, okay guys this is all about the normalization introduction so in the next session we will study the dependency then plus the normalization okay guys so this is all about the session and if you my videos are helping you please guys like and share these videos and moreover please follow the playlist its link is under the description of this video please guys follow the playlist so you won't skip any video and every video is sequence wise okay thank you and take care